when an old Gallagher's mates goes, uh, all right, no, it's from Blackpool. I think talk like that. Russell, do you want to meet the Dalai Lama? And I thought, well, this ain't going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Before I knew it, I was he's around the da- here in this van. I got him here. I just like you know, I see him walking round in the park. So I've just give him a dig in the gut, <laughs> stuck him in back of my transit. But uh, he was like, um, he goes, oh, do you want to meet the Dalai Lama for some sort of thing? And I went, well, yeah. I'm thinking this will never happen. <laughs> yeah, right. Cobblers. Yeah. And like then, for a minute, Dalai Lama, like. <laughs> Well, not before I knew it. There were some administrative stages where I had to speak to these various emissaries. Is this where he had a magic carpet and you trod on it and stuff? That's right. I right. stomped up and down on his magic carpet. So what, well, what did I he say He about? wouldn't care about a magic carpet. They went. There was a carpet leading all the way from the dressing room to the stage and they goes, someone goes to me, don't step on that because it was at the Manchester Arena. Don't step on that. That's the Dalai Lama's carpet. I thought, you don't care about that. Why is he going to? He's not going to. He did care, didn't they? Be reincarnated five times and then like go, oh, well, that's my carpet. You won't care, will you? Will you? Anyway, also another thing on the Dalai Lama list, he pulled my beard and it actually hurt. Yeah, I know. But what was his thing about ego? He said you're a prick. (laughs) (laughs) Brought to you by Audioboom.